So I actually haven't made a video in quite a while. Like, I want to say like close to two months, but I'm not actually 100% sure. Um, my birthday just passed recently, actually. it's It was on uh, the 20th. Um, so, you know, I'm 20 years old now, which is great. Um, I got an iPhone 6, which is actually what I'm using to record now. Um, and I'm here with my... Say hi, Miz. You want to say hi? She, she just came in. We're having, like, a big storm right now, so... She's kind of all wet. Well, she's drying off, but, you know. She's all wet. Um... So yeah, I haven't made a video in like two months. There just hasn't been any progression in terms of like my transition, but I kind of wanted to make a video as well talking. Um, it's related to my transition, but uh, it's a little more focused on uh, my own mental health. So I'm just going to say a trigger warning. Like right now, I'm going to be talking about like very sensitive material. I'm going to be talking about like suicidal, suicidal ideation and attempt. I'm going to be talking about depression. I'm going to be talking about anxiety and dissociation and unreality and medication and all that. Um, so just, you know, sort of as a warning uh, to let anyone that watches me that is sensitive to this kind of stuff to... Um, you know, it's just, just a warning. So, I started medication almost a month ago. Um, it's like, it's Ciferex? I can never pronounce it, but uh, it's something like that. It's an antidepressant, and it's used for depression, anxiety, and OCD. Um, and I just, like, of all of January, I just, just had this, like, strong, strong urge to just straight up kill myself and I was very 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 close to doing it as well um got Owen down here too he wanted to say hi um and I'd already I I've talked about this I think in a different video but I had attempted suicide um 10 times in like 2014 like mid 2014 all the way till the end of 2014 um, and I didn't end up in a hospital um, but it was very very scary and I was very dead set on ending my life and in January I just like of this year I got struck with this huge huge urge to just kill myself like it's something that I really really wanted to do which is when I sort of had to step back and tell myself, okay, therapy is not fully helping me. I need to get more help. Um, and I did. I finally took the step to get medication. Um, and it's been helping. Um, it's been helping a lot, and I'm really glad I took this step. It's not a cure, of course. I'm not even looking for a cure. She's, she's watching what I'm doing. That's you, Miz. Little girl. Okay. Um, where was I? Oh yeah. Um, she's been watching. Not sorry. That's that's not what I wanted to talk about. Uh, this video is gonna be kind of rambly because my thoughts are kind of really disorganized at the moment. Um, but yeah, the medication has been helping, and just the urge to kill myself has helped me go and get the medication that I need. Um, and it's not a cure. That's what I was talking about. It's not a cure. I'm not looking for a cure. I don't want a cure for what I'm going through. Uh, I mean, it would be nice to n never have to deal with what I have to deal with every day. But, um, it's not going to get rid of my depression. It's not going to get rid of my anxiety. It's not going to get rid of... The fact that I dissociate, it's not going to get rid of my depersonalization. It's not going to get rid of any of that. All of that was induced by trauma that I had to deal with since I was three. So it's something that I just... I'm going to live with for the rest of my life. 
um, however long that may be, and I really, I don't even know where I'm going with this video, I don't know, I just, I'm trying to give some kind of update, um, just, just something, uh, to put on my channel, and I know it's very, it's a very upsetting video, um, but it's something I just kind of want to get out there to, um, you know, and a lot of it does have to relate to my transition and stuff like that. Um, you know, I get a lot of social anxiety and uh, a lot of, like, social dysphoria, um, especially with my chest and with people not using the right pronouns or, uh, you know, calling me she and her and that happened today and I was just so thrown back. I was like, oh god, maybe I'm not passing as well as I thought, and I've been on hormones for over a month, not a month, over a year, and it's just, maybe it's like, is it not working, and I freaked out, um, but I was also under a lot of stress and a lot of anxiety, I couldn't find the place I was going to, I'd lost my wallet over the weekend on my birthday, I got it back, I uh, lost all my money though, so whoever turned it in also took all of my money. I hope that person gets bad karma. Um, Miz keeps trying to be in my videos. She's so pretty. I love her. <laughs> what is- No!